this video tutorial will explain how to, to solve a basic ordinary differential equation you just, let's consider the ordinary differential equation y prime equals 2y and y of 5 equals 2015 Um, here we have the ODE and this this part is the ODE which stands for ordinary differential equations and um, this 2015 part is considered as initial value we did we represent it as Y note initial value in order to get an initial value, we must have an initial point. So this 5 is T note, is the initial point. point. The formula is when you have an ODE plus initial point, Let me raise this one nicely. So, write down. You have an ordinary differential equation, then you have an initial point given. Plus an initial value. Equals initial value problem. Let's solve this one. Y prime equals 2y. What do you, this demonstrates dy by dt on our left hand side and side and this is our right hand side equals to 2y. Using the separable method, we separate the variables. So dy 1 over y equals to dt. Now we can integrate the both sides. 1 over y dy equals to dt you can write, write this as y inverse y dy base. actually it's not y inverse y to the power negative 1 to dt when we differentiate the same but there's a trick we don't need to write this one I just wanted to explain that we could solve this from this step. So I'm going to take it to this side. ln y equals two t plus c one. How did you get this ln y? The derivative of the den denominator is on the on the numerator so this comes from the basic uh, calculus differentiation and uh, so far we integrated only integrated the both sides so you know that when there's no t where we could read write this same thing as 1 over y dy equals 2 outside t note dt this implies this part this part t note 
equals one. So it's the same thing. That's how we got this. Now we have to apply the initial conditions and before that we we need to simplify this. This is actually it's, it's on the implicit form. The solution is on this implicit form. We take the uh, e to the power ln y equals e to the power 2t plus c1. This will become y equals e to the 2t to e to the c1. We can rewrite this as a, with a new new constant. By the way, c1 is a, is a constant. So we'll rewrite this as y of t equals e to the 2t capital C. Capital C is a constant. We can obtain the value of this constant by using the initial values. How to do that is it's very simple. Use the values given. So y of t equals e to the 2t c. Whoa using initial values we can obtain e to the 2 times 5 because t note is 5 as it given here equals into C two O one five. So C equals two O one five into E to the negative two times five, which is two O one five E to the negative two. Thank you.